the experience of traumatic invalidation really hits you at the core of your social uh, social system. And social system is means we, we all are social beings. We cannot survive without our group. And um, I would say in, in when our psychological apparatus evolved, the first thing we learned is you have to be to, 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 to stay in your group, whatever it counts. Since if you lose your group, you're dead. So this means uh, whenever you are threatened to not uh, to be rejected by your group or getting out of your group, it's a question of life and death. So social synchronization, what means I, my emotional system is equal to the, to, to the, to the, to the system of my peer group is the primary basic for survival. Social invalidation then means that my, 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 my basic principle uh, of social survival is questioned. And uh, so this means it's, you're threatened all the time. It's, uh, you, are, you, you don't know what to do. You don't uh, know how to interpret it, uh, messages from others. You don't know how to inter interpret your own messages. This means you're always on the level of, um, of uh, fear of being rejected and abandoned. And this means you cannot do anything else but this. This means this patient cannot stay alone since they're ruminating all the time. What happens is outside there. Can I trust anybody? And, and so on. So targeting this, I would say is, um, yes, I wouldn't say the one uh, intrusions are less important than traumatic invalidation. It's, 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 it's the same. It's, it's, you, and the, the, the basic idea is that you understand these are two different systems. And these, these, these crazy ideas psychotherapists often have is that they have this one, one treats it all system. So if you treat the intrusions, then everything gets back. That's not true. It's like you have a multiple organ problem. You have a heart, you have a liver, and you have a spleen. And uh, if you have problems in the heart, the liver, and the spleen, and you only take the spleen, then you have still problems in the heart and the liver. And then you have therapists who say, oh, okay, the spleen is the most important. The other ones I don't think. I say, no, 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 you have three problems and you have to target all these three. Since otherwise you can, you can save one problem, but this mean, doesn't mean that this client can create a life worth living. So for this reason, I meanwhile think that if you want to understand complex PTSD, we have to consider at least the disorder is a dual hit uh, idiopathogenesis. The first hit is the trauma, which may be a sexual or physical trauma, and the other is a social traumatization. And um, yes, and so going more in deeper details that this is a different mental process than the trauma itself, and it requires a different treatment approach, um, then we get a little bit closer <laughs> to the thing.